how to create a digital product mockup in Canva. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how we can create a digital product mockup simply using the free tool for design called Canva. It is very easy and very simple. All you have to do is as always follow up the tutorial from the beginning to the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is you go and head to canva.com. Then you are simply going to uh, sign in to your account. Then we are going to select a design, for example, or right here, I'm going to type on the search bar. You can go ahead and select a template or simply go to create a design. Then I'm going to click on custom size. Here we are going to choose a size to make the uh, templates for. I'm going to use this one because it is used uh, generally for uh, showcasing products or digital products and also thumbnails. I'm going to set here the background color. Let's go ahead and set a background color on this like that also or like that. And then we are going to start making the uh, mockups. But first you are going to create the mockup uh, or the uh, digital product. For example, let's go ahead and see that we have something like that and let's say that we are going to search for something that you have created uh, uh, ebooks or website building or newsletters it is up to you let's say that you are a newsletter creator or a website creator i'm going to put for example this newsletter let's go ahead and get this image right here i'm going simply to download this image get it and then we are going to be set up i will wait for the design to load up then i'm going simply to download it i'm going to set it as a png download wait for the download to be proceed then we are going to the uh, website or the uh, page that we have now simply i am going to upload the image that is being downloaded and as you can see we have it right here now for the presentation or the mockups for the digital products, it is um, going to be, for example, for computers, uh, phones, tablets, and etc. All you have to do is to go ahead and select the image right here. I'm going to make it a little bit smaller, put it outside here, and then we are going to search on the elements. You are going to put, for example, frames like that, and we are going simply to search on it. Here we have the frames, for example, you can see all of the frames that we have. You can go and set this PC. We need this PC frame. And we have also this uh, laptop frame and the phone frame. And why not the tablet frame? As you can see, this is the white borders and this is the black borders. I'm going to shoot with this black borders like that. Simply, I'm going to arrange these and make them near to near each other. For example, I'm going to make this uh, PC right here and the tablet. Simply, I'm going maybe to make it this wide or like that. Simply, I'm going to add the design to it. Let's hope and see if we have a, a horizontal tablet. Unfortunately, we don't have but it is okay i'm going to put the tablet right here like that and simply i'm going to add the design to all of these i'm going simply to put the design on the tablet first then i am going to uh, the for example this one then i'm going to put it on the phone like that and uh, here we have it and click on another time click on and add it to the pc for example you can go ahead and select the image that you are going to showcase on the pc like that by simply double tapping the image and for this one i am going to add it right here click on twice showcase the uh, part that you want to show on this pc or this particular frame and you have it now this is for example the uh, the mockups that are standard this i have used this for the newsletter i'm going to use it for example for the wix website that i have created and go, let's go to wix.com then we are going simply to wait for the website to load right here and then i'm going to take some screen 
uh, shots of the website with my PC, then we are going to get the uh, also the uh, photos and make them for the design. First, I'm going to download this as a reference, click on share, download and make it as a PNG, download and it will be downloaded right away. Here we have it. Go to the website that we have. I am going to visit the website in the preview mode and we will let's see everything right away. It is very easy and simple. It will take a little bit of time, but it is okay. Now I'm going to start deleting the images right here for that. And simply we are going to make something out of it. This I can also put the position on it. I can also make them on top of each other or make them in, in the back of each other like that. This is maybe more convincing like that. Here we have it at the corner and here we have it. This is a set, I think. Yes. Now let's go to the website I have. I'm going to click on preview and I will see the website. Take some uh, screenshots of it. And here we have it. For example, this is the uh, welcome page. I'm going to uh, take a screenshot. Then simply I'm going to paint. This is the paint. Then I'm going to press control C. We have here, uh, for example, this one. I'm going to save this on the downloads like that. Put this without a title or for example, I will name it 145 like that. This is the first one. Then I'm going to select file new, put another screenshot, for example, with this one, go back to paint, put it right here. Uh, I'm going to save it, for example, 156. Then we are going to select this one or that one, for example, let's go ahead with this one and also screenshot, select a new file, copy paste, download it like that. Simply we are good to go. Now, the th second thing that you need to do after you have set everything right here, upload the image, upload it by yourself. Go to the downloads, click and create these files. I'm going to select that, add it right here to the website. This one may be to the laptop. And this one is for the tablet. And let's add another one to the phone. I'm going to add it to the phone, for example. And I'm simply going to put it right here. For example, like that. And here we have, this is the product page and here we have everything set up. When you finish everything, you are going to simply click on a share download and as planned, you are going to download it as a PNG. That was very simple and very easy. That was all for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one.